he also revealed himself to be a long, orange-haired, fey entity, and revealed that he had no idea what he was doing, and he desperately needed your help. And that was where we left off. As the Traveler, hood held back, standing above you, tall, kind of lanky, graceful limbs, eyes filled with mysterious age and anxiety, looking towards you, continues on. I am not any less than I have been, for the pretense itself is a bit of trickery, and I think that even you can appreciate that, Jester. I am Lord Artagon of the Morn Crown, and I am the Traveler. You, Jester Lavore, are my protege, my most prized pupil. You hold the purest priorities to see the world turned on its head. I know I can trust you. Will you help me? Well, obviously. Good, good, I knew I could believe in you. <laughs> um, I guess, our, our tagging? The Traveler is fine. Traveler, um, <laughs> do you want this? I Do you I'm want to be a god? <coughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm enjoying aspects of it. I've enjoyed the um, the adoration. I've enjoyed the extensions of my tangled web finding its way to generally twist and tease the mundane idiots that seem to permeate this plane. <laughs> Uh, but I've reached a point where I generally don't know what to do from this point forward. I don't know if I have too many followers. I don't know if I should just cut free and run away. Well, I mean, do you get more power from more people following you? It feels that way to an extent. If they follow you, do you have to answer them? Not always. I mean, I haven't always answered you. Oh, I wish I could have, trust me, I really wish I could have, but I'm not one entity. Well, I mean, whatever we decide, um, I mean, are you still going to hang out with me? If you'd have me. Okay, good. I would be really sad if, you know, you didn't want to do that anymore. Oh, if I was to leave, I'd take you with me. Oh, that's fun. Where would we go? All sorts of places. Now that the doorway has been open for some time, I think we can travel quite easily through many of the planes, maybe other worlds. This is but one of many prime materials. I'd be curious to see what else relies out there, huh? Me too. I mean, we have to, you know, take care of some stuff here first, but. Um, do, do, do you know what's going on with everyone that you know I'm hanging out with? No, not entirely. They seem rather boorish, though I do worry that half-orc mama's boy seems to have picked up on my recent sloppiness, if you will. Oh, well, he would never judge, you know. He's. He's actually really polite, and um, I mean, yeah, kind of a mama's boy, but not in that way. I mean, he's really reliable, is really what it comes down to. Your, your friends, your companions. Yeah, yeah. Um, what are their thoughts on us? Um, they all seem pretty supportive of it. Um, you know, some of them are like, oh, I don't know, I've not heard of him before, and I've told them all about you. Well, I mean, so it's still know. kind of a new thing we're working on. Right, The branding right. aspect but of But here's the question, I mean, should I be telling people about you? Well, of course, that was the whole idea. Well, I know, but what? the more people I tell, the more people that are going to want to rely on you, and I you'll know. have to answer to them, what do we do? That's why I'm here, I don't know. What? I like the attention. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. I have, 
here's here's hmm. an option. Yes. What if you know at TravelerCon, we like establish you as like this god that can always hear, but you're more like the other gods, you know, that are like, oh, you know, like okay. So Caduceus, he worships like this wild mother. I'm familiar. Yeah. <laughs> And so, like, when he asks her questions, you know what she does? She Nothing. blows the wind. Exactly, she does shit. <laughs> so, and he's like, oh, I sense, you know, I understand what she's saying. She's not doing anything, but he thinks she is. Interesting. Yeah. So and he, he seems uh, content? Yeah, yeah, he's like totally into her. <sighs> People are strange. I know. So um, you could be like that, you know, where people ask you things and you don't do anything, and they'll still think you're doing something. But I've already been so involved. Won't they be disappointed if suddenly I'm just not appearing? Well, we just have to establish it as like there's like a new way of doing things, you know. Interesting. Like you've gotten so powerful that you're always, always with us, and you hear our thoughts, and. Um, you control everything, and so the party is a goodbye, kind of. But well, not for me, not for me. Just for right. all those other people that are like less important. And now they have friends. They've met. They can. They be can a rely on each other. All right, I love that. Totally. When anything goes good, it's because of me. If anything goes bad, it's because of them. Right, or you know, they'll find greater purpose in the bad things. You know, they'll be like, oh, everything happens for a reason. It's ridiculous, but I I'm happy for them to be content with that. I know, that. I know. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> Nothing happens for a reason. It's absolute fucking chaos. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Love him. Oh, no. So, I mean, one of the things we could do, you know, what if I just had everybody, like all my friends, you know? Yes. What if we got to TravelerCon? And we were all like your high priests and high priestesses and stuff. And like we helped establish how the religion was going to be, you know? We could show people how to pray to you if they haven't done that before, you know? All right. I'm going to warn you, it's a very <laughs> eclectic mix. Are any of them as powerful as me? No, not at all. Okay, so we can totally fool them. Yet. Okay. What? Well, you got to make sure I'm always ahead of them. Well, you're doing great. I'm not, look, just a, don't worry, just don't get lazy. I'm never going to be lazy. I know. Well, so we gather your friends, convince them to help. You yeah. act as acolytes. Um, yeah. We have a celebration, Yeah, what shows. are we going to do there? I mean, what do we do if like, give like, a concert or like. No you know. theater. But. <laughs> music. <laughs> music, perhaps. Okay. We can bring some performers in. Okay. Um. Yes. Yes, refreshments. Yeah, obviously. Right, right. Yeah. We could do some displays of power. I mean, it is a volcano. Maybe we can make it erupt. Well, just make sure, you know. That, well, I mean, it would solve your problems if like, they all got wiped out at the same time, I True. suppose. Then they wouldn't be relying on you anymore, but your power might get less. It's not even about the only. power at this point, it's just about keeping it interesting. Oh, well, then, you know, that could be something. But, you know, I'll be there and you love me so much, that would be not so yeah, fun. Yeah, there's no valid you know. point, no volcano. Yeah, okay. Yet. Wait till we leave. Maybe. <laughs> so, should it be like a ta-ta and I leave into the sky? I, I mean, should maybe I we can make you. Can turn you to dust? Can like you make yourself grow like super, super, super big, and like fill up the whole almost sky? Like you know, like this great big presence, and then you like lift up and you you disappear, and we're like, oh, he has said. A visual ascension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And now I'm with them at all times, yeah, not like, answering a damn thing. Right, but they'll think I you're even it. bigger than you you ever have been. You're answering to so many people, you can't possibly be there with them personally. But they'll have each other. Delightfully foolish, I love yeah. it. We'll tell you, we'll tell them you can also communicate through the wind. 
I feel like that's a bit hackneyed territory, to be honest. All right, all right, all right. Melora kind of kind of leans in that space a bit heavy for me. Okay. Well, we'll still clear <coughs> of that, I guess. But all right. Well, let's let's table the miracle for now. I'll I'll put some thought to it. If anything comes inspiration-wise to you. All right. But we should definitely come up with some sort of ceremony to make you ascend. Right. All right. Okay. I'll start assembling some flowers, pillars, Ooh. an archway. Ooh. I've got some ideas. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, what? Can you open up your <laughs> gateway and like bring some stuff in from another plane and that way like people are seeing things that they've never seen before and it'll make it like even more powerful and special there? I, uh, I can open a gateway. The gateway to my home realm mm -hmm. Um, is a bit stationary, but uh, I can still give the essence of it. Okay. I can make it presentary, grandiose. I like it. Illusory, but effective, especially for the layman. Okay. And I will make um, programs, you know, to pass out to everyone, so they'll have like a, something to take home with them, and Keepsakes. they can get, yeah, yeah, yeah. Things to shadow box. Good, yeah. good. You know, yeah. It's important to have a physical memory of the occasion. <laughs> yeah. A reminder. Good. See, this is why I came to you. I'm so bad with planning. You know. I'm more of a kind of in the moment and improvised kind of. Understand. I mean, obviously, we'll leave room for craziness <gasps> to happen. Oh, there will be craziness, my jester. Don't you worry. <laughs> hmm. All right. It's give me much to think about. Did you want to come say hi to everyone? I mean, they're going to be your high priests and stuff. They appear to be sleeping. That's true. Do they like being woken up in the middle of the night? I mean... How do I wait till breakfast? How do they've eaten? We'll eat, then you will like come in, see if we can fool them and make them think that you're like, like even bigger than you are, right? So like, they will like see what we can do for them to make other. It'll be like a test run. Okay, so mm, all right. So we're trying to trick your friends as well. Yeah, but then we'll we'll let them know. I'll follow your lead. Okay. You'll know when I arrive. Yes, I will. Chester. Well, uh, I just. But does this mean you're not always with me? It means I'll be with you as much as I've always been. And if they're not yelling into my ears as much, maybe I could be around more often. Okay. You're still my favorite. And you're always mine. Go, rest, and he extends his hand and you watch as all the local bush kind of yeah, bends and pulls away. Yeah, you do this away. the rest of the time, though? Because this would really help our track through the jungles. Oh, I'm sure it could, but I've got a lot to do oh. with the planning and the individuals, you understand. But I'm, I, I've given you some tools. I'm sure you could find your way. We'll find our way. Well, if you rely on me continuously, how are you going to prove yourself? How will I be more powerful than everyone else? Exactly. I'm going to find my way back. You don't even need to make this path for me. I'll take it, but you don't need to. And walk, walk really fast away so that he doesn't take it away as I okay. make my way He does this with his hand, and you watch the little flowers go boop, 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 kind of following your footfalls as you make your way through. It can just be beautiful. It doesn't have to be helpful. And you kind of just run forward and look back, and he's gone.